All right, welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to Final Fantasy VII Rebirth on PlayStation 5. Actually, the only place where you can play this right now because time exclusives and whatnot. Big thank you to our friends over at Square Enix for providing an early review code for me to play for you guys. I don't know why I have to say ad slash sponsored, but I'm not getting paid, but they still are asking me of this. That's just the way it is. And this is the very first big game of 2024. And honestly, I need it quite a bit because things haven't been going that great in my personal life at the moment. Um, Family-wise, had multiple members of my family in the hospital. We got bad long-term prognosis of the health of our eldest dog. So honestly, 2024, pretty crappy uh, thus far. But uh, in those situations, we look to video games to kind of provide an escape and doing these videos for you guys brings me quite a bit of joy as well so we're just going to tough it out hopefully 2024 improves along the way and let's jump right into it with a recap of the story of the previous game that's that's fun right right yeah when there is so much to tell where should i even start with all that we saw what we heard, what we felt, this planet of ours, destiny, our part in it. Best to start at the beginning, perhaps. Midgar, the city of Mako, ruled by the Shinra Electric Power Company, who drained the planet of its very essence, the life stream, and processed it for industry as Mako. Our world was dying, and so few could hear her cries for mercy. Those who could rose up in her defense. The anti-Shinra rebels, Avalanche. Among them, Cloud Strife, an ex-soldier hired by the Resistance to destroy Reactor 1. In Sector 8, amidst the aftermath of the attack, Cloud met a flower seller named Aerith. She offered him a yellow blossom. One said to symbolize reunion. And thus was destiny set in motion. With Reactor 1 gone, Avalanche set their sights on Mako Reactor 5. Unfortunately, they were playing right into Shinra's hands. The company was able to draw the wool over the people's eyes. And in the end, destroyed Sector 7, killing thousands and laying the blame at Avalanche's feet. Though dear friends were lost, Avalanche had no time to grieve. Aerith had struck a deal with Shinra, who took her into custody. With her capture, Shinra's obsession was within reach. The fabled Promised Land. For Aerith was the last of the Setra, the ancient stewards of the planet. And only she could guide them to paradise. To save her, the team infiltrated the Shinra building, the company's beating heart. It was here that I, another prisoner, joined their story and assisted them in freeing Aerith. Yet during our flight, we came face to face with a man thought dead. The vaunted war hero, Sephiroth. Before he could be stopped, Cloud's foe fled with the corpse of Genova, the cataclysm from the stars and the catalyst of our plight. Eventually, we too made good our escape. Pursuing troopers defeated, we raced toward Midgar's edge. Yet Sephiroth once again intervened. Suddenly, 
deafening screams rent the air. Whispers, the arbiters of fate, descended upon the city. Before their imposing wall, Aerith warned us. This was destiny's crossroads. Every moment, every action, every step taken had all been as the whispers willed it. To fight them was to break free. On the other side of fate, Sephiroth waited, the whispers undulating within him. Cloud brought his blade down upon his rival, sundering destiny. With the fight won, and the shackles of destiny broken, we stood before the unknown, a world of boundless freedom. It was there, beyond where fate could follow, that a new journey began. All right, so obviously we had to disable the music because YouTube is very stringent with the copyright system. My deal to you guys is always the same. This first episode, no music. All preceding episodes, we will turn back music on up until YouTube <laughs> shuts us down. Uh, but the part one of the series pays the bills. So we got to make sure that we, uh, we, 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 get, we get it right. So uh, don't worry. Music will be back in the next episode. Just bear with us as we start our new game and jump into it. I've tried this already. It did not work. Default. Off. No one likes the controller microphone, okay? Or speakers. No one likes that. I was thinking of just keeping the music on, but I talked to another YouTuber who also does Let's Plays, and he just told me straight up a ton of stuff gets flagged. <laughs> so uh, we, 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 we can't do anything about it, ladies and gentlemen. You just have to kind of bear with it. I'm waiting, Cloud. I'm here on the Midgar Expressway. The scene is indescribable. Countless buildings have been leveled and part of the road has collapsed. The smoke rising from the rubble is reminiscent of a funeral pyre. Of course, this is only the most recent in a series of crises. Multiple reactor bombings, followed by the fall of the... I <sighs> the fall of the Sector 7 plate, culminating in this unprecedented destruction caused by a massive tornado which swept through sectors 0, 1, and 2. After a briefing with Shinra investigators, Mayor Domino released a statement <laughs> declaring the tornado to be, quote, weather warfare perpetrated by the infamous insurgent group known as Avalanche. The administration also suspects the involvement of Wutai and has begun investigations into the matter.
It's the boys. Title screen hype. Already? What's that? Of course. Ten minutes this in? This is only the most recent in a series of crises. Multiple reactor bombings, followed by the fall of the... Uh, the fall of the Sector 7 plane. Boy, that tornado really did a number on the city. I thought another reactor blew up. Which must have been caused by the tornado. Man, when it rains, it pours. As you can see... Ah, over there! Oh, no. Amidst the wreckage of the expressway, search and rescue operations are already in progress. We still have one suspect so right. unaccounted for. Ex-soldier, armed with a buster sword. Highly dangerous. I repeat, the fugitive is an ex-soldier, armed with a buster sword. Huh? Back over here! Get him on board! board. Prep for takeoff! The rescue team has pulled people from the rubble. Sorry, sir. Hey, Quick, uh, get the camera off him. It's our squad. Come on. This way. Contact the SAR team. Targets have been secured. We are exfilling via Hilo now. Move it. We're taking off. What? Turn that off. The survivors are being taken away! I can't hear them already! Oh no, we're not quite kill you! Excuse me. Could you look after my friend? Just for a bit. <laughs> Too much yep. Mako, but he'll be fine. <laughs> hey! Take this strapping young gentleman who is obviously passed out. Could be worse. Could be worse. Aerith! Oh. <laughs> Red's going in! Yeah, take down that chopper. Okay, get to play a Zack right away. I like it. I like it. We can't currently do anything in terms of attacking, so I guess we just walk. That would be the best walker in the car. Talking about me. Get away from her! He's got a buster sword! We get, we get terrorists. Yeah, we do. So, what I hear, your levels Unfortunate, but I guess we don't want to use it too early. Go! Oh, I think. Heads up! <laughs> so anime. Come on, let's get him! Replayed myself with the combat from the previous game, but it's okay. We'll survive. We'll survive. We'll relearn. Oh, my lady! The 
Thank you. Bro, you're just not gonna leave him there, are you? Come on. What kind of cold hard Where's the agent? Heads are gonna roll if we don't find her. Just shut the hell up and search! This is so messed up. All of it. But I'm back now, Aerith. I'm back. We've got the time. Want to tell the rest of us about you and your buddy Sephiroth? Sure. If Tifa doesn't mind. Me? Yeah, no problem. It's cool. It all started five years ago. I was 16 at the time. There was hardly any work for soldiers back then, and what little there was was boring as hell. My heart wasn't in it. Then, out of nowhere, the job of a lifetime came up. A mission with Sephiroth. I couldn't believe my luck. Chapter Uno, Fall of a Hero. It's really coming down, huh? Hey man, feeling any better? I'm good. Sure don't look it. I wish I could help, but never been motion sick. Sorry, man. Ready to do this? Yeah, you bet. Damn, 16 year old Cloud's so chatty. Fablum Brook over here. What happened? <laughs> hey. Rain it in. Sorry. No can do. Kids. Say, I'd like to be briefed on the mission at some point. Because if it's another one of those Turks gigs, you can let me off right here. Really? Finally make first, and what do they do? Call a ceasefire with Wu Tai. Stealing my shot at glory. I didn't join Soldier to be an errand boy. I joined up so I could be a hero, like you. <laughs> well, our mission is to survey a rundown reactor. Another one of those Turks gigs. Ugh, <sighs> fine. Job's a job, I guess. Where is it? Nibelheim. Nibelheim? That's where I grew up. Got some fiends at our 12. Let's go. They have testicles underneath their chins. <laughs> you take one, I'll take the other. <laughs> Did 
Big ol' greenhorn. <laughs> Wait in the truck. No way! I got this! <gasps> <laughs> it's my first day. in a different league from the rest of us. Nibelheim. That's where they built the first reactor. Right? Yeah. It all started in the fall. Something was wrong with the reactor, and the whole village was up in arms. Talk of strange new monsters on the mountain only made things worse. People were scared, desperate. The villagers tried to take care of the monsters themselves, but it was no good. Ended up calling Shinra. So the company sent help. Best they had. Sweet home, right? Tell me, how does it feel? I have no home, so I wouldn't know. Uh, you still got parents though, right? A mother named Genova. She died shortly after I was born. My father. Whoa there! Genova? Like from the Shinra building? Yeah. Don't worry, I'm getting to that. <laughs> hmm? <laughs> Why am I talking about this? Come on, let's go. Hope I didn't keep you waiting. I'm Xander, the mayor here. I wanted to greet you myself, to uh, welcome you to our humble little town. Please, if you'll follow me. Consider yourself off duty till sundown. Ah, uh, we can dodge now, guys. We are home. So from what I gather, there's uh, some sort of branch timeline nonsense going on mixed in with a little bit of uh, <laughs> crazy Kingdom Hearts storytelling. Yeah. So let's just walk around, see what we can do. Ever since we heard a survey team was coming, we've been working our fingers to You worked out with everyone? Just for a bit. Could you keep up? Get my yogi on. Oh, I didn't realize the survey team was here. Thanks for coming. We really can't handle this ourselves. Then I stop by my mom's. Not that it matters. Sure it does. I know I want to hear what happened. Me too. Yeah. Go on. My dad died when I was a kid, so after I left for Midgar, she was on her own. It was the first time we'd seen each other in two years. First time, and last. Hmm? 
I'll be right there. Mama! <sighs> Cloud, is that you? Hey. Welcome home. Come in. Let me get a good look at you. My, my! So that's what they've got you wearing, huh? You soldiers sure do clean up nice. Cloud, your mom is hot. I've never been so proud. The man you've become? Women must be hounding you day and night. Not really. You know, there's all kinds of temptations in the big city. I'd feel a lot better if I knew you'd found a good girl. One who'd make sure you didn't get into trouble. I can take care of myself. An older, more mature girl that could keep you on the straight and narrow and tell you when you're being a silly goose. That's the perfect type for you, I'd say. They are feeding you properly, aren't they? Oh, Cloud. But you know, Cloud. Wouldn't you agree, Cloud? You're my son. Of course, I'll always be... Okay, that's enough. Never, it's never enough. Talk to your mom. <sighs> that sword's huge. So, Can I touch it? Just speaking with that. Uh, so, one, so earlier, like about a month ago, um, my mom actually got hit by a cement truck while riding her bike. So she was in the hospital for a bit. Um, that was the first major thing that we had to deal with. And uh, she's fine now, but uh, it was kind of not a great situation for my family. And then last week, uh, Tara's mom Goodness. actually went to the hospital. I don't feel that I, I... Since it's not my mom, I don't really want to disclose why. Uh, but she was in the hospital for a week and was released. So, yeah, there's a lot of stuff going on uh, health-wise in Tara and I, <laughs> our lives. That, uh, and, uh, yeah, it's basically where I've been for the last bit now. Just kind of holding the fort down and trying to... Make sure everyone's good, family's good, but yeah, that that scene with Cloud's mom just kind of brought you, up a whole Cloud? bunch of feels that I didn't really want to talk about, but it, it it is what it is, right? Let's 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 move on. Let's move on. Hmm, a soldier. And you are? Richard Sangan. A humble traveler of the world. And teacher of martial arts to the youth. Hmm. <sighs> Damn chicken arms! Hmm. Dude, hmm. personal space. Well toned, but lacking mass. You need to bulk up. Who asked you? <laughs> this guy looks like a Tekken character. You could learn a lot from me. Pass. Don't be shy. I have many pupils your age. At last count, 128. In fact, one of them's from this very village. Perhaps you know her. Tifa. Sure. A real talent, that one. She'll go far. <laughs> yeah, right. Yeah, right? Got anything to say for yourself? I didn't know. City folk are so sophisticated. Can only imagine what their lives must be like. Faint scenario in. Goodness! Is that oh. you, Cloud? Who said that? Who said that? So, how did it feel being back up there? I don't know. Nostalgic, I guess? After two years away and all that. 
Dude, that's legal. Peeping Tom over here. Get that Please, sleepy sleep. Didn't really notice at the time, but looking back, all the signs were there. From the moment we arrived, Sephiroth just wasn't himself. What you looking at? This landscape. Huh? I could swear I've seen it before. You okay? Big day tomorrow. We'll be leaving bright and early. You should get some rest. All right, we'll do. Night. He seems like a stand up fellow, a genuine nice guy. I tried, but I couldn't get to sleep that night. Was too excited, too nervous. Was pretty much the same for me. Why? <laughs> yeah, I was surprised too. You know what happened the last time she went up there. That was years ago, Brian. She's old enough to make her own decisions now. <laughs> Did this guy just sleep in? Really? We leave once our guide arrives. Yes, sir. Uh, Brian! Sephiroth, sir. I must insist that I take you up the mountain. My daughter isn't... Dad! Tifa. You can still back out. You don't have to do this. I'm going, and that's that. There'll be two soldiers with me. I'll be fine. Pumpkin. Easy there, you perverts in the comments. Good morning, sir. Relax. I'll be your guide for the day. Tifa? You're our guide? I sure am. You can ask anyone around here. I'm the best there is. You could get hurt. Not if you remember to do your job, she won't. Come on. For a posterity, sir? Not today. Can you talk to him? Please, Sephiroth. It mean a lot to us. It's just one photo. Come on. Where's the harm in that? <sighs> um, there? Thanks. Say cheese. Sounds like you were having a good time. One more. Yeah, I guess we were. Later. For a while. The reactor was halfway up Mount Nebel. I was looking forward to breathing that crisp, clean mountain air again. Ocean?
You probably already know this, but our reactor's the first of its kind. It really put Mount Nebel on the map. I've seen a few reactors in my time, but none with such a breathtaking view. Who could tire of it? Everyone, eventually. Man, I wish I could go on trips all over the world like you guys. <laughs> trips? I think you mean business trips, which are no fun at all. Though you do learn stuff on them. That's so cool. Hey, look at that scale! Next gen is here. Also, bad news for Sony. Uh, for all the people affected by the layoffs, Sony laid off 900 people from their gaming division. So uh, hopefully those people uh, get on their feet, find some new work. It's just the way the industry is. It just it sucks sometimes, but we try to make the best. Everything out of it. okay? Not going too fast for you, am I? Of course not. We're just trying to pace ourselves, is all. But I thought you guys were in a hurry. Even so, you'll burn yourself out running like that. I'm not even close to burned out. Not with all the training I've had. Huh. Guess you really are the best there is. I'm sure they're all very talented people and they will land on their feet somewhere. <coughs> Yay. Need more, need more slashy slashy here. You look weak against fire. Seen those near the village, and they're not nice. What do you think? I think I got this. Then they're all yours. Copy that. Dodging, you see the lunging at the sack. Now. Let's finish this. Get that stagger, baby. It's on now. You're done. Bye. Bye bye. Huh? Sloppy. You think? If this is how it's going to be, there doesn't seem much point in me fighting. I guess not. You leave it all to me, huh? <laughs> Don't mind if I do. <laughs> I see you leaping. Sneak up on him. Let's finish this. You gotta say, that one felt pretty good. I like it. I like the abilities. Don't, don't you push me. Wow. Is that Mako? Whoa. Sure, you can do better than that, can't you? Just you watch. Oh, 
Oh, come on. I want, I want the perfect block. Come on. So if you perfect block it, it becomes. Ah. Is ineffective? Yeah, work on the on the blocking, but the uh, the dodging's good. Dodging's good, guys. Clear fries again. All yours. You know what to do, Cloud. <laughs> Let's finish this. Probably keep an eye out on the other enemy. Shit. Gotcha. Back here. Rock about to go in. Well done, Trooper. Thank you. I got the rest. It's on now. I forgot what the difference between operator mode, basically all the modes. <laughs> oh, with that. Shit. Oh. Burn. Finish this one first. I'll end this. Oh, I'm gonna do it, dude. Fight's not over yet. Let's finish. We still have a long way to go. Shall we pick up the pace? Not unless we absolutely have to. Our guide might not be so lucky next time. Then, how about I go on ahead and clear the way for you guys? I'll be careful. <laughs> you better. Cool. See you at the reactor. Yes. Probably heal. There you go. Now we're talking.
yeah. We really want to stay in operator. Right? Felt pretty good. And with a cure, maybe. Wind attacks. Don't have any of those. Alright. Alright. Dude, come on. We gotta block. <laughs> Let's finish this. Come on. See ya. You're done. Time to get serious. Piece of cake. Try to make that a little bit more smooth the next time. I heard that. I heard something giggling at me. Back up there. <laughs> Need you to grab that. Please. Thank you. Aha! Just in time. Wind materia. Hey, not that way. It's a dead end. Rockslide took out the bridge a while ago. Come on back, okay? Okay. <laughs> Probably going through that crack in the wall. I was one step ahead of the game. This way. Gotta make a detour through a Shinra facility. To think I almost made you our guide. Good thing I reconsidered. Otherwise, you'd have led us straight off a cliff. Lead on. Yes! 
It's okay, we're new. It's alright. It's my first day. Boss battle coming up. Placing me with potions. Like it. I don't know what that is. But I'm assuming it's good. Oh. Link materia by one. Tight fit. Weak against fire. may have been around for a while, but there are still pockets of Mako gas all over the mountain. Try not to breathe it in if you can. I don't want to get Mako poisoning. That's locked up. We go this way. around like a machine like this cleaning floors for a full year ah <laughs> oh, good times not really good times but nostalgic you, got, you gotta do what you gotta do 
to afford school, right? You gotta do what you gotta do. I like how everyone is as destructive as I am. I like it a lot. Come on. Just thinking about crossing that thing. Then let me go first. Hey, I'm the guide here. Sword swing. Bridge is going down. Okay, no light. Light is going for. Tifa, are you okay? Not really. The last one, guys. <laughs> Thoughts and prayers to our fallen soldier. He's in fate's hands now. Do you know the way? Yeah. Following the river should get us back to the village. We're not going to the village. Can you get us to the reactor? Sorry, I... I don't think I can. I see. Well, we certainly can't send you back alone. You'll be safer with us. Okay. I'll be joining you up front this time. What? For your performance review. You kidding me? Good luck. Yo, cheat code game just became easier. bit of a breaky break here we go I'm assuming you guys these guys are probably weak against fire but we also Off have you go. Band supper. Oh.
Come on. Fuck you! Are you? So long. No, I ain't. I ain't changing. I ain't changing. More Mako gas ahead. There's no way around it either. Just have to go. Not waste any time. Mako, this thick is dangerous. For so long. Let's hurry. Mako. So dark. Big boss, let's go. A Mako spring. It's beautiful. <sighs> yeah, but if we keep using Mako to power our homes, springs like this will disappear, right? What are you talking about? Who told you that? My dad. And the mayor, if you must know. Except the planet's huge. Mako will never run out, right? Naturally formed materia. And look at the size of it. Astounding. For the Mako energy to condense into something like this, it must have taken an eternity. I've always wondered, how does materia let you cast spells exactly? <laughs> how did you ever get to be a soldier? Hmm. To put it simply, the knowledge of the ancients is sealed within each orb. That knowledge not only connects us to the planet, it allows us to tap into her power. That's how we can use magic. Or so they say. Really? Magic sure is weird. <laughs> <laughs> I know someone who'd be livid to hear you call it weird, or magic for that matter. I can just imagine what he'd say. It's an affront to science. Who? Hojo, from Research and Development. His predecessor was a great man, but him... He is anything but. <laughs> we should press on. Beware of gas. Stand back. Call Zephyroth! 
You're in Take the lead. I've got this. It's a piece of cake. Yo, it's teamwork? It makes the dream work. Change. Ooh, something new. Steady. <laughs> Okay, well, thanks for telling me now. You're done so well. This way. Man had no weaknesses. What a luxury. This is so janky. <laughs> One at a time, people. One at a time. We gotta lose that last soldier right here. He is about to bite it. Just like his buddy. I want to go down first, or do I want to go in here first? Let's go down first. <coughs> little little detour to get that materia. <coughs> Magnify. I don't know. I should probably... I'll check the uh, status of my interior a little bit later, but I just want to keep the uh, pace going on right now. Get to the end goal. People are just appearing out of nowhere. Not again. A zoo? Synergy skills. Huh. Cool. All right, then. I'm assuming this brawl won't let you down. It's called Void Shatter. Show them what we can do. Assuming he's weak against arrow. It's 
It's all you. Stand back. Stand back. This won't be the last. Yep. So far, combo feels good. Game looks good. Obviously, it's more of a linear Final Fantasy, not open world. But I I'm down for a linear game. Not everything has to be open world these days. Sometimes bad open world is just like if they try to like force feed open world, it's just not a good situation for anyone. So long. Let's hurry. Man, broth so. Broken. Oh, oh, almost. Goodness for this gigantic beam of blue light. Whoop. <laughs> Come on, grab that. Auto cast. Auto cast cure. That'd be useful. Where's a vacuum when you need one? Right on cue, baby. Got a shorty. We're two stuff here. Bench. Oh. <laughs> Elixir. Handing out those tier one items.
Elmo one. I like that I can just pass through the other characters. They don't impede my my movement. That is very thoughtful game design. Ahead. Looks like a way out. Looks like a battle zone to me. Something about to fall on our heads. Wait. This way. You said you wanted to be a hero. Wish I hadn't. It thinks we're after materia. Someone should tell it we're not. That'd be my guess. Maybe try to set it up more? Try to mix it up. You need to bury your attack. I know. I want to see what you're weak against here. Okay? Chill. Fire. See? Try to keep your guard up. Wow, just, just constant curving here. Not doing so great. Rookies. Get me out of here. Should it be too hard? I got him, I got him, I got him. Stand back. Time to kick it up a notch. Burn. Stand back. Damn it. Not again. Get it together. Oh my god, he got grabbed again? Cloud, dude. <laughs> On me. Done. Sephiroth. Pretty mobile. Until we knock it down. Good thing I don't just fight with a sword. Go for the legs. Calling fire. Take out his legs. Now. Got him. Move in. Copy. It's all you. You're in good hands. Get that stagger, baby. Watch him learn. How to do a limit break. Get him. <laughs> ah, there it is. Octo slash. <laughs> It's all you. Stand back. I got this. Get him. <laughs> Dead yet? 
you're practically panting. I'm excited. <laughs> Such a puppy. Double helix synergy? Don't like the looks of this. Stay alert. I got your follow my lead. Copy. You're gonna need my help. Yes, sir. Maybe he'll go. Might want to steer clear of the gas. <laughs> it's all you. Stand back. What is this refresh? Get him! <laughs> Got ya. Take it from here. Nice work. Daddy. <laughs> okay, hold up. Maybe I'm missing something here, but everything you've said makes Sephiroth sound like a stand-up guy. Well, he was. And now he's pure evil, trying to kill everyone on the planet. Help me to understand this shit. Tell me something that'll really make my blood boil. Oh, I will. I will. You wait out here, Tifa. No way! I want to go too. Please? Sorry, no civilians. Even if we weren't on a mission. Come on! Keep the young lady safe. Carry on. Ah! <sighs> you better keep me safe. So much sass, dude. How's the, uh, <laughs> I was about to say, how's the, how's the, how's the health situation going on right now? Hopefully there's another bench coming up in our near future. Didn't expect it to be all systems go. You'd think it'd be running at reduced output, like most last-gen models. Then let me guess, pillagers don't have a clue about this. Knowing Shinra? Of course not. The company really needs to be more transparent. Tell that to the president. What exactly is the problem with this place? The people in charge. While most reactors are under the jurisdiction of urban planning, this one is overseen by R&D. Huh. Why do I suddenly have a bad feeling about this? Whatever you see here, you are not to speak of it. Oh, I won't.
What we got cooking? Slide off. Oh, wait. Yeah, there it is. There it is. Perhaps you'd like to say a few words to your sword first? something. What are those things? Genova? Wasn't that... Malfunction must be forcing the pods to depressurize. Cloud, go out and shut off the valve. Copy. Those chicken arms, Cloud. <laughs> Come on. How many turns to get to the center of a Tootsie Pop here? There we go. doing these pods were built for the production of artificial materia but hojo repurposed them as incubators cages for animals shields with mako all to birth a new breed of monster but he didn't stop at animals Oh no, there were other subjects. Look. Created the same way. Am I the same as these monsters? Sephiroth. Ever since I was a child, I knew. I knew that I was different. That I was special. But not like this. 
not like this. <laughs> Am I even human? Eventually, we went back to the inn. But when we got there, Sephiroth locked himself in his room. The mayor had been looking forward to having dinner with bona fide soldiers, so he didn't take the news too well. Dad had to put up with his belly aching for hours afterward. Huh? Hmm? Must have sucked. But what about Sephiroth? What happened to him? He left. Didn't tell a soul where he was going. Dude's having an existential crisis. I met crisis. Sephiroth as he was heading for Shinra Manor, and he acted like I wasn't even there. Busy, I suppose. He's holed up inside the mansion. Something's been off ever since he came back from the reactor. Too much exposure to Mako? Then we ought to bring him some medicine. That guy runs weird. If you're looking for Sephiroth, I saw him headed toward the mansion. Sephiroth wasn't looking so hot when he passed by. Everything's okay. Shinra Manor was the biggest building in town. And older than the reactor. The company used to conduct research there, back when they were still a small manufacturer. Even so, the rent on that plot was basically what kept the village afloat. Well, here we are. What now? I mean, the whole place is pitch black. You think he's sleeping or something? What if he's sick and needs our help? Hey, a little Mako poisoning isn't gonna hurt a living legend. Safi. Took a look around the place, but Sephiroth was nowhere to be seen. <laughs> Never knew it had a basement. Was news to me too. Doubt anyone in the village had a clue. Some real nonsense happened here. Excavated from a 2,000 year old rock layer, a life form in stasis. Professor Gast named this life form Genova. M-E-G-L-77-1977. Genova. Verified as an ancient. Uh. M-E-G-L-913-1977. Genova project approved. So, they named the life form Genova. And once they understood what she was, they grew ambitious. Hey, Sephiroth. What you got there? Leave me be. And that was it. He stayed holed up in the basement. Reading and reading, like a man possessed.
We got Genova. A locked reactor door. The name of Sephiroth's mother. An ancient. Ah, screw it. Racking my brain's not gonna get me anywhere. May as well just ask the guy. across the most fascinating passage. The specimen found in strata dating back 2,000 years smiled with what could only be described as ethereal grace. Though the truth eluded me at first, I later determined that she was an ancient, or a steward of the planet, as they are referred to in legend. She needed a name. And so I dubbed her Genova. The Genova project was approved soon after. A bold initiative to resurrect the long dead ancients. An initiative that resulted in my conception. Or rather, my creation. The crowning glory of Professor Gas. Wondrous experiment! He created you? should go. Mother is waiting. Hey! Hey! Hold on! I keep asking myself, why couldn't I have come too sooner? If I had, maybe I could have saved the village. Or tried, at least. What? He burned that mother down! Hey, you! Get in there! The villagers need your help! Still here, so keep your eyes peeled. God, get your head straight. I need you to secure the way out now. Y yes, sir. Zephyr? But he. Why would he? Mama. No moms. 
Stop the bombs. Come on, just pop that leg back in. Move a little faster. Is this? Am I gonna die? Hold on, Mom. I'm coming. Just throw some, just throw some water on that man. And of course it's empty. Please. Please be okay. Sefa. Mom. Mom. Get you up. It's so vicious. Period. Severov, stop! You sick son of a bitch! That's far enough. Drop the door. Get out of the range of his sword. <laughs> or walk closer to it. Sure. <laughs> At this point, man.
Wait for me. I'm coming. So badass just walks to the fire like nothing. I followed Sephiroth all the way back to the reactor. Dad and I had gone there to hide. When Sephiroth showed up, Dad decided that he was going to confront him. It was Sephiroth, wasn't it? He did this, didn't he? <laughs> Sephiroth. Soldiers. Mako. Shinra. I'm sick of this. I'm sick of all of this! <laughs> Mother, I have come for you. Now, open the way for me. You murdered my dad! You burned my village! Here I am, your son. Mother, together we will reclaim our world, and I know exactly how we can do that. The Promised Land. Sephiroth! <laughs> Mother, they have come again. The ones who robbed you of the planet. Your planet. But there's no need to be sad, Mother. Because I'm here for you. 
now and forever. You killed my mom. You killed Tifa. My village! My home! <laughs> they were mine by right. This planet too. For I have been chosen. I believed in you. No. Not you! Whoever the hell you are! And that's the last thing I remember. The rest is a blank. The hell it is? What happened? It was all over the news. I remember watching it with my mom. They said he went missing during a training exercise. But then, the story changed. A couple days later, they started reporting that he was killed in action. Yeah, that was it. The news outlets are nothing but Shinra mouthpieces spewing propaganda. Only dumbasses believe that shit. Question. Does that make me a dumbass? Uh, I didn't say that. What I meant was... Screw Shinra for manipulating honest folks. It doesn't matter what they said back then. Sephiroth was in Midgar. We fought him. Whatever happened, he's alive. Don't know about alive so much as... Around? But why come back now? After five years, doing who knows what? Because... He wants to finish what he started. He wants to reclaim his birthright. And rule over the planet, with Genova at his side. After five years? Not to sound like a broken record, but... It's really bothering me. Well, what's bothering me is all this Genova stuff. <sighs> Excuse me. Guess the travel or something really did a number on my back. Feels as stiff as a board. Let me take a look. Mm. Ah! Wow. You weren't kidding, were you? Let's get you back to the room. Yeah. Let's just call it a night. No amount of guesswork will get us any closer to the truth. So how about we give our heads a rest? Uh, oh, no, you don't. That bed's mine. Sweet dreams. See you tomorrow. Oh, man. Hey, Aerith? You awake? Barely. Why? Was wondering, what's Cloud been doing these past five years? Where's he been? And you're asking me this? Just had a feeling you'd know. Probably did at one point. All that stuff was taken from me, though. Or maybe erased?
By whispers? Yeah. Maybe that's why. Why what? <laughs> this is gonna sound crazy, but as far as I know, Cloud was never in Nibelheim five years ago. Cloud, you up? <laughs> you up? <laughs> Yo, when you get older, guys. Yo, if you know, you know. <laughs> you up? <laughs> All right, ladies and gentlemen, we are done this episode <laughs> of <laughs> Final Fantasy VII Rebirth. First episode done in the books. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed all the way through. If you are and gonna enjoy the series, thumbs up, greatly appreciated. We're gonna turn on the music back in the next episode, hopefully, and look forward to more. And uh, yeah, it's, it's uh, got a lot of stuff going on in my life right now, but uh, like I said, video games are always a great escape to escape real life sometimes. And hopefully, you guys are gonna. Uh, join me the entire way through and we'll keep playing together. All right. Thank you for uh, joining me and we'll play together very very soon